Hi Aquarius. Hello Aquarius. Welcome into my channel. Thank you so much for being here and I hope that you're doing well. I'm here to present to you your love reading. All right. I am Sage Sunset. And I'm going to intuitively read these cards for you to see what is coming up in your love life for the next seven days. Let's get started. Okay. Aquarius, I see that there's things, be, there's things manifesting, working, getting through, getting through feelings, emotions, like working through feelings not giving up, like feeling things through. This could have been ideas, projects, businesses that you're working on, just seeing them through. You may not be really feeling the success of it because it is not here yet for some of you, but you're working through that. Just you're just in that space of getting your hand in the dirt, in the creative essence that you bring, and you're just working it through. Maybe you're working on an idea or there are thoughts in you that you're just, going through because so that's how i feel for you so there's also new beginnings for you so this could be what you're working toward i feel like it is a new beginning of stability function being able to function stably being able to function from a, a mature or stable place having your own foundations your own groundedness i see financial stability here and this could also be a sense of self-worth in yourself so in love i see many of you actually working on yourselves and that is so beautiful. It's as if you're turning all of your attention on what you on what it is that you have to offer. Like being happy at work in yourself, not looking for outside attention, but looking inside. And this is that innate sense of value with the ace of pentacles coming through new beginnings or so i feel like this is a brand new feeling of belonging of having value self-worth just feeling good within yourself i feel like just this person has found themselves and is just turning that inside being happy inside out i love this energy for you in love or some of you could be extending your family so this is momentum in love for you so you could be adding to your relationship possibly a baby or it doesn't have to be a baby could be a family member that's moving in with you that's you know going to be an addition to the family here something to celebrate also in love here it could be third party energy i'm not meaning it's infidelity but it could be just as i said maybe a grandmother moving in or friends i feel like you're being directed towards evolving in love also aquarius maybe putting more putting your all into into relationships so there's always also guidance for you to really keep doing what you're doing, develop your skills. And I feel like you're very skillful. That's what I'm saying. I've sent a lot of creativity here also within your energy, Aquarius. <clears throat> hmm. Five of Pentacles. So yes, this is yet another feeling of being at that, that roadblock of getting through, but you're still moving forward. So even though it might not feel as if you're reaping the rewards as yet, for some of you, Aquarius, you're still moving through, you're trusting the process, and that is what I like. So maybe some of you are actually just going towards feelings of self-worth and value. You're just embarking on this journey. Maybe some of you are just detaching from a relationship that wasn't good for you. You know, negative attachments I feel here. Someone being left out in the cold, not understanding each other's feelings, just this detachment, wanting some space to be alone. This could be you, this could be your person, Aquarius. Well, justice is here. I think that uh, for some of you, you may be making excuses as to why you haven't moved on yet. Um, maybe feeling like you have to care for other people's feelings, you know, before really starting to look into yourself and love on yourself and developing your sense of self-worth. I feel like maybe you are making an excuse that you have to, you have to have certain things in your life or certain situations. So even though they're not serving you and possibly really keeping you from leveling up in that sense where you want to really focus on you 
develop yourself um even feels drip um Sometimes maybe you feel drained and are looking for affection and you're trying to just move away from things that aren't serving you, but maybe you just feel stuck a bit. As if you don't know what to do, how to say no. So this is an issue of boundaries. So that's why I feel there's a new beginning of boundaries being established. Aligning with your, your, your stability in you, what you stand for, justice. What do you stand for? Just really need to align, knowing when to say no. Knowing when to move on, when to let go. Knowing when to focus and work on yourself. Okay, Aquarius? That is, these are the love mes messages that are coming up for you. I feel like it's just a lot about value. Standing up for yourself. Oh, gosh. Uh, I feel like some of you could have, of course, hurt... Uh, being let down emotionally, have lost someone, a situation that caused you to just kind of shut down a bit. And this is another five. So we have three fives here on the board for you at that crossroad of how do I move on? How do I stop looking at what I've lost and carry on? When do I say no? I feel like you're just stuck in that emotional energy of wanting to move away but still a bit caught up in the past some attachment here to to someone maybe you feel like you owe this person something or this situation and you have to keep it around you but justice may be coming and playing in your favor something is going to cause you to really look around or, or turn around and move forward in the direction that will serve you best direction that will be best for you for you wholesomely you know what makes you happy hmm. the king of pentacles grounded financially stable so some of you could already be financially stable and this is where you're heading this is what you want to feel that stableness footing balanced it could be coming in for you like so this is holding you up it could be a business it could be a family business actually just always being wealthy some of you could have worked toward this for yourself here working diligently using a gift that you have a creative gift and actually establishing your own business over here hmm. You could be moving away from a person that could be a, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. What a sign. There's a, but what I know though is that there's a new beginning for you. Hmm. So this is, there's a lot of pentacles card coming up for you. Self-worth. This is you glowing up. Goku card. Powering up inside out. Looking good. Feeling stable and balanced. And I think, I think this is definitely what you're moving toward. You may be, you know, moving away from a relationship. Being single for a while. Just working on you. And this is how I feel. Like, just turning that energy on yourself. And looking good going out in nature just feeling splendid about who you are not feeling like you need someone or not allowing someone to really be dependent on you but to 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 be strong enough in yourself to see what it is that you want moving forward So that's the moon card, Piscean card. The moon card represents secrets. What is hidden? What is not really revealed? What is be behind the veil? And this could be in a relationship. I feel like this could also be you walking into solace within yourself, that place of peace in you, a calling, like allowing your emotions to pull you into a place that is more serving to you. A secret may be revealed to you. I feel like you could be walking actually or coming into a place where something is being revealed to you. It could be an awakening. For example, let me tell you how I feel here. As if this person has just been walking like this with their head down 
for a while and then it's like they come into this whole new vibration they just come upon this whole new kind of a portal and the energy is felt so much that you can't stay stuck in your vibration any longer you have to really open i mean lift up your head and embrace what is in, in front of you so something is being revealed that is going to cause you to shift out of the energy and i feel like that is what's going to really cause you to move into your best self to realize that you don't have to continue on like this you have a say a secret so be a secret about this this water sign that's behind that's in your life possibly <laughs> so th there, here's another five again a conflict a conflict in yourself a, con a conflict with your family how to move on brotherhood here a conflict with your brothers i'm just wanting i feel like you are in the conflict i don't feel like you want to separate from it you are actually in it you are one of these people here that are wielding your wand you have something to say you have your peace to put in you like you have you are a part of this you're out there wielding your peace too having your say you're just still fighting maybe to be heard or fighting to be Beat for justice, it could be, you know, fighting for justice. I'm so sorry about the, the vehicles. I don't know if it's, it's loud on your end, so if it is disturbing you, forgive me for that. Okay, ooh, we have fortune, so there are good things coming to you, though. It feels like Aquarius, hmm. Huh. Okay. As if the action, the creation, these manifestations, whether it be quarrel or whatever it is that you're going through, the fuss, the, the contention, the conflict, it's it's it keeps things moving, it keeps things active, it, it's creating momentum and it's bringing some good possibly because this is the wheel of fortune. So it's bringing in some good, something, I feel like something good might come out of it. Like a load may be let off. Maybe it's anger and intense emotion, desires. Wow. Someone might be coming back around in your life, a past love. So for a love reading, I feel this is the second or this is the second cups energy that we're feeling out for you. This is a past lover. This is that equal give and take in love. Um, that beautiful kind of giggly, pure energy of just being smitten by someone, wanting to see them and talk to them, wanting to give them flowers, take them out on dates, just wanting to treat someone how you feel inside of yourself. And you're being, you're receiving that energy as well. Maybe some of you are afraid that your person could be giving love to someone else, and that's why you're walking away to really focus on you, Aquarius. Hmm. Oh my gosh, the world's hard. So maybe someone from your past is really coming back into you to offer you some feelings of affection. I feel like it could really be this past person. Coming back out to maybe to say sorry, to, it's going to bring you some warmth. I feel maybe maybe they're coming from afar. Maybe they're traveling to see you, or you're traveling to see this person. The world card also is a symbol of having a baby, bringing something new. I mean, someone <laughs> new into the world. It could be something as well, a creative idea, right? Something is coming into your world. It feels pure, like a new feeling. Hmm. And we also have the Wheel of Fortune, like a blessing. The first energy, yes, I feel it. It's, it's like a propeller for something, maybe good, maybe positive. That's how I feel. 
so yeah yeah just brace for something good someone coming back offering you some feelings of affection of love forgiveness um or just saying sorry you're up here working on yourself your internal world developing your sense of self-worth being grounded just having boundaries and standards your own identities morals beliefs what keeps you moving forward and going okay aquarius oh we have the the soulmate card the marriage card here and on the bottom of the deck we have the ace of cups that's love coming in a flush of emotion of emotions emotional fulfillment for you aquarius this has been your love reading interesting um thank you so much for being here and i hope that you found messages that resonate with you if you did please give my video a thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel your support is much loved and appreciated and until next time aquarius remember that you can be do have everything and anything in this world that you desire dream big because you are all and all is within you much love bye